Hi, welcome back to my channel. Guys, today it is Tablescape Tuesday. And so we're approaching the 4th of July. What I'm going to do, I'm going to do a 4th of July table. But my table is going to have thrifted, Dollar Tree items, and it's going to have Vantage Chinoiserie and Modern stuff. So this is uh, what you call a mix match in DIYs as well. Guys, today is Tablescape Tuesday. This is hosted by the Grace Life DIY Home Decor and Amethyst Adventures. So, of course, we have to start with a clean surface. <laughs> And then I will bring my white tablecloth. This tablecloth was thrifted from the Goodwill. So that's how we're going to start with. I don't know if you guys can see the pattern. It has like some lines on it. It's a nice tablecloth. <laughs> it's long for my table, of course. So that's how we're going to start with a nice white tablecloth. Now, uh, we'll be using, this is DIY napkins that I did a long time ago, but I'm doing a set of, a set, a setting for two, and they have silver around it. It's like type of shabby chic because you could see the little uh, thread around it as well. So that's what are we going to go with, all right? And guys, I will leave the link of the two ladies in my description box below so you guys can go and check them out and show them some love. Here we are. we're going to start and then we're going to layer with this as well and there you have it and with that we are going to use silver chargers guys today is Tuesday the day that I'm actually recording this table scale. so we're going to go with that I really didn't know what I was going to go with, but you guys know me. I start putting things together and at the long run, it's going to come out nicely. Also, I'm going to go, these are very old place. I got them, this store for Family Dollar from almost 10 years ago. And my husband bought those. So, Hanson, it's a red, white, and blue table. We're going to go with Vantage Blue and White Chinoiserie. I will put those as my salad plate. <laughs> okay. And then I have, um, hold on. I'm going to use for coaster, which they are not really coasters. They are my saucers for my plates. So I'm going to use this little plate as my coaster for one of my glasses so i will place that right here you gotta get creative guys i don't have any coaster that could match this i mean i could use glass coaster but i decided to go with this i think that'll bring it more together <laughs> now with that i have a dollar tree you know i don't know if you guys seen this this is the dollar tree uh, runner that they came out with so I will be placing that here right on the center so you guys can see the stars. It's not a wide enough, but it'll do. All right, guys. Um, I'm going to shop my house and see what else I'm going to put in this table. So I'll be right back. Guys, I'm going to go with these beautiful thrifted glasses. You guys can see they have red, the little red right there, cobalt blue. So I will be placing the cobalt blue glasses in the red um, plate little saucer 
that I'm using as coaster so it looks very nice. And I will be using red glasses as well. So we will place that there. I think that looks very nice, nice combination. And we will repeat the same thing on this side. All right, now I'm going to use thrifted candle holders and the candles are also thrifted. So that's what I'm going to be using. So let me grab those and I'll bring you guys right back. That is what we're looking like. Also, I'm going to be using these napkins that I uh, fold. I fold double napkins and I'm using one of these ornaments from the Dollar Tree as the, nap as the napkin ring. So I will be placing that here as well. You got to get creative, guys. It says, uh, dollar, it says ornaments, but once you buy them, they're yours. You could use them however you like. So I decided to go mine and use them as napkin rings to bring the stars on the center to the setting. All right. So that's what we are doing. Just a simple napkin fold. One is one way and the other one. So they're not fold the same, but the concept is the same. Okay, we will be using silverware. Silverware. Okay. I am not using a dessert spoon or what you call a spoon for tea or coffee because I will not. You guys know that my signature is I always have a teapot on my table, but today I will not. Because remember, it's the 4th of July, it's hot, so we're going to have different beverage. So most likely I will be having a pitcher with some lemonade or something else on the table. All right, guys, what else am I missing? I feel like my table needs more because you guys know me, but I also just for ha ha, I'm going to be throwing this little um, garland that I bought from the Dollar Tree SF USA. Yeah. All right, guys, I'm going to be bringing mine centerpiece it's not a, it's not an extravagant centerpiece it's a small one this is a candle holder is very old i have it for over 15 years it was a gift so in there i cut a little um paper you know that you get with, when you buy flowers so i'm just going to put it here to cover the ugliness because i don't want this to show so i just put that there and then on top of that, I'm going to uh, um, add my simple um, cobalt blue flower arrangement. And on the flower arrangement, I added a bow tie from the Dollar Tree. Guys, it's simple, it's elegant, but I love it. So yeah, guys, I think it turned out very nice. But I don't know, I feel like it need more. So what do you think, guys? Maybe some more flowers around it? All right, let's add some greenery. Let's see how it looks like. All right, guys, what do you think? I think now it looks like it's done. I love the way it turned out. These are some uh, flowers that I thrifted a long time ago. See? So I decided to add them here. Guys, sorry about the back of my head. Um, so... I think it looks very nice. So guys, let me find my lighter because I don't know where it is. I always put it away and I will light up the lights and show you what it looks like with the candles on. So let's do that guys. I'm happy. I love it. Yep. I love it. I hope you like it as well. 
And I think I forgot something, which is right here, which I will be placing at the middle of each plate, which is a silver napkin ring that I will be using um, on the plate with a little tea light candle holder. So you guys can do that. It, it gives it more of a light. Oh, I'm actually going to place it right here on top of the plate. I don't want to cover the chino on to be um, displayed. All right, guys. Maybe I'll leave it there. Maybe I'll move it around. I don't know. Let me light up the candles and make the decision. Guys, I think that this table for be put together at the last minute. You will see this table today on Tablescape Tuesday, today. So, yeah, I think it turned out very nice. I love it. Um, there it goes from the top. That's where I put the napkin rings with the little um, board of candle. And this is a Vantage Chinois to replace. Okay. Dollar Tree Play. Silver Charger. Dollar Tree... Um, I guess a placemat, and this is the napkin that I DIY that is bigger, so I'm using it as a placemat as well. So I think it turned out beautiful, guys. This is what it looked like. Thrift the candle holders, I'm red and silver on the inside, and of course my Cobo Blue with red candles, guys. Um, I don't know what you call this uh, flower, but they didn't have any names, so that's what I got. And then here is my simple flower arrangement. I placed a bow tie from the Dollar Tree. As you guys can see, there's the bow tie. And roses and white peonies and little uh, white flowers. Right now, I can't remember the name of the flower, even though I know what they are. Also, a garland from the Dollar Tree. So I want to thank Anna for hosting this collaboration. Um, Courtney, thank you, and Anna, thank you. I appreciate it for giving me the opportunity of always taking part in this collaboration. So, guys, let me come over here and leave it like I always say. Be kind to one another. Don't forget to smile. Overall, stay safe, stay healthy. And remember, guys, God loves you, and Debbie also loves you, too. It will be until the next one. Bye-bye, guys.